Hello, everyone. See you in a few minutes, okay? Welcome.
Okay, people, let's get started. I'm going to take the attendance. Mm -mm -mm. Give me a second. Okay. Please respond when you hear your name, okay? Uh, Alba Luz Cruz de Vasquez. Wait a minute, wait to hear your name. Alejandra Maria Mejia. Present teacher. Okay, welcome. Carlos David Lopez. Carlos David. Claudia Margarita Constante. Claudia. Concepción de Lourdes Núñez. Present teacher, I'm here. Okay, welcome. Christian David Galicia. Present teacher, I am here. Okay, welcome. Dalila Cristina Gómez. Presente, teacher. Okay. Elena Marisol Peralta. Gabriela Alejandra Ramírez. Hey people, si no responden, yo no puedo ponerles asistencia. Gabriela Noemi Orellana. Present, mister. Okay. I'm here. Welcome. Ileana Elizabeth Hernández. Present. De los quebrantados, dice. Ingrid Morena Ventura. Present teacher. Okay, welcome. Jefferson Alexis Pérez. Present teacher. Okay. Jenny Akane Molina. Present teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Jose Antonio Montes. Present teacher. Okay, welcome. Luis Alejandro Mendoza. Present teacher. Okay, welcome. Mariela Araceli Martinez. Present teacher. Okay, welcome. Olga Lisette Valdez. Present teacher. Okay, welcome. Rina Margarita Arana. Present teacher. Welcome. Telma Yamilet Hernández. Present teacher. Okay. Verónica Alicet Alas. Present teacher. Welcome. Vilma Aide Cortés. Vilma Aide. And Wendy Beatriz Aguillón. <laughs> Wendy, a quick review. Alba Luz, Carlos David, Claudia Margarita. Present teacher. Okay. Elena Marisol, Gabriela Alejandra.
Bill my day. Wendy Beatriz. Oh. ¿Quién está acá? Ok. Um, Teacher, un compañero yes. en, en WhatsApp en el grupo puso Carlos Amaya que no se va a poder incorporar a la clase porque va manejando. Pero ah. cuando llega a la casa quizás se va a conectar. Ok. Ok, thank you. Ok, people. Let's see. A ver en qué nos quedamos. Okay, okay, here it is. Okay, we, uh, at the end of the class, we were working on these three postcards. Yeah. Let me share the screen to check the exercise. Okay. So, um, I lost five pounds and feel terrific. I think is is the is Debbie. Okay, what about the second sentence, people? This was kind of dangerous, but we got there safely. Who said that? According to you. Kevin or Margaret? Ah, oh, you didn't do it. Come on. Mm, Kevin? <laughs> okay. Let's see. They're talking about the Alaska. Yeah. I guess it was Kevin. It was dangerous, but we got safe there. They are going to Anchorage. Okay. That should be number two. And the last one, it's a tiny island about um, 2300 miles west of Santiago, Chile. Definitely, that is number one. Okay, now we have these questions here. Which person learned a lot on vacation? Uh, Kevin, Debbie, or Margaret? What do you think? Which person learned a lot on vacation? Margaret, Debbie, yes. or Kevin? Mm. Let's, Margaret. Let's, let's do something. <laughs> write, write your answer in the chat to see. Uh, we may have different opinions, but write your answers in the chat. Which person learned a lot on vacation? Margaret? Debbie? Kevin? Mm. Write your answer in the chat, please, in Zoom. Write your answers in the chat. It's very slow. Very slow. Who learned? Which person learned a lot?
My goodness, this Zoom is very slow right now. Um, studied the stone, yeah. Oh, look, here it says. I really learned a lot. <laughs> yeah, most of you are right. Oh man, this is too slow. Which person learned a lot? Yeah, I I agree with most of you that that was Margaret. Okay, number two, who had a vacation that was full of adventure? Who had a vacation that was full of adventure? Write in the chat, please. So number one is Margaret. Margaret learned a lot. Okay, let's see. Who had a vacation that was full of adventure? Let's see. One of you. Yeah, I think it was Kevin. Yeah, he went to Asda. I come home with my trip in silence. Number three, who had a very relaxing vacation? Mm. Who had a very relaxing vacation? Yes, yes. Who had a very relaxing vacation? Mm -hmm. Definitely the girl who went to Hawaii. And finally, which vacation sounds the most interesting to you? Yeah, here there is no correct answer because it's your opinion. For me, well, because I am not too young, not young, <laughs> I prefer Debbie's vacation. For me, the most interesting Although Alaska, it's terrific, okay, very exciting. Um, Easter Island sounds very amazing oh, with a lot of information, with a lot of... For me, right now, Debbie's vacation is the most interesting to me. To go Hawaii, relax, have massages. Um, oh, that's for me. But maybe for, for you is different. Okay. Okay, people. Very good. Now let's continue with the. Next unit, uh, which is what's your neighborhood like? Hmm. Interesting. What's your neighborhood like? We have this vocabulary about places. What's a? 
It's a place where you you have to match. What a barber shop. Well, it's a place where you <clears throat> where you get a hair. Yeah. What's a barber shop? A place. It's a place where you get a haircut. Continue with the rest. Okay. Library, borrow books. Es la G. is station story travel agency Para eso hay que poner fotos, imágenes. La de la gente es F. La cuatro. Digo, según lo que ya te di, ya te atendiste, ya te dije entender, es que iba a hacer letras. No, es sí. Ya no va nada. No, la cuatro es. La cuatro es la F, la cinco. Trae de la gente. Sí, amor. El sur. En el cual es muy para la de la computadora. Comprar alimentos. No, que la vamos a pedir. Y no copias a la imagen y después la imagen. No, no, no.
Okay, people. I will send you to working groups to check your work for exercise A and to work on exercise B. What are you going to do on exercise B? Well, on exercise B, you have to write definitions for these places. Like this. You have an example here, a model. Okay. A clothing store. What is a clothing store? Well, it's a place where you yeah. find new fashion, for example. So you have to, right now you're going to compare your answers on this. Okay, barbershop, it's a place oh. where you get a haircut. Continue, compare the, the other. And later, continue with exercise B. On exercise B, you have to write definitions for clothing store, drug store, internet cafe, music store, and post office. Okay? That is what you are going to do. I already um, placed this in WhatsApp. Let me form the groups. Oh, we are 19. Okay. Five groups. Three, four, four. Okay, go to your groups, please. Compare your answer for exercise B, A, A and write the definitions for exercise B. See you in around 10 minutes. Join the breakout rooms, please.
Okay, so let's check. What's a laundromat? Can you tell me? Se diría literal A. Okay, but I want a response. I want a... Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, London was under close. Okay, but sí. you have to start from here. It's a place ah. where you... A London is a place. Uh-huh. London is a place where you was under it close. Okay. I mean, it's a place where you wash and dry clothes. A laundromat. Laundromat. Okay. Very good. Let me enlarge this a little bit. A laundromat is a place where you wash and dry, and dry clothes. Okay. The second one, what's a library? It's a place. Library. It's a where place you... where borrow, 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 It's a place where you borrow books. Okay. Barrow books. Barrow books. Okay. Barrow books. What is a stationary store? It's a place where you buy cars and cars and paper. Okay. Stationary store. What's a travel agency? May reserve reservations for a place. Make reservations for a trip. Okay. It's a place where you make reservations for a trip. Good. What's a grocery store? It's a place where you buy food. Okay. And what's a uh, theater? It's a place it's where you see a movie or play. Okay. Very good. Very good. Now. On the second exercise, there you have to write the definitions, okay? What's a, what's a clothing store? It's a place where you find new fashion. <laughs> okay. What's a drug store? It's a place where you buy medicine. Okay. Yeah, it's a place where you buy medicines. That's good. What's an internet cafe? It's, it's a place a where, you where you find you... information. Okay. Any other? It's a page. Only that? Any other definition? That is good, but just to hear another one. About an internet cafe. What's an internet cafe? No more. Okay. What's a music store? It's a place where I find my favorite music. Ah, okay. Okay. 
Then what's a post office? It's a place where you can send letters. Okay. Yeah, that's right. Very good. Well, I need to clear these drawings. Now, I already recorded that conversation in WhatsApp, so you have it there right now. Let me read it for you here. Okay. Conversation between Jack and Mrs. A. Let me see. Excuse me. I'm your okay. new neighbor, Jack. No, I'm sorry. Excuse me. I'm your new neighbor, Jack. I just moved in. Oh, yes? I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there any around here? Yes, there are some on Pine Street. Oh, good. And is there a laundromat near here? Well, I think there's one across from the shopping center. Thank you. By the way, there's a barber shop in the shopping center too. A barber shop? Hmm. One more time, listen. Excuse me, I'm your new neighbor, Jack. I just moved in. Oh, yes? I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there any around here? Yes, there are some on Pine Street. Oh, good. And is there a laundromat near here? Well, I think there's one across from the shopping center. Thank you. By the way, there's a barber shop in the shopping center too. A barber shop? <laughs> okay. Now, I will send you to uh, like five minutes to small groups to work in pairs, actually. I hope everyone gets a partner to practice the conversation. I already sent the conversation to WhatsApp. So um, I want you to practice the conversation in pairs, okay? I will give you five minutes to practice the conversation. So let me create the groups. Three, two, 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 two. Okay. Okay, please, people, join the breakout rooms because we are working in pairs. To not join the breaker rooms, to not leave anyone alone. Okay. Do, 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 do. Great.
Okay, people. Um, we have time to hear a couple of, of groups. Any volunteer to present the conversation? Me, teacher, Elena. Okay, Elena and Alejandra. Okay, go ahead. Can you share the the, the screen? Please? Ah, okay, okay, okay. Sure, no There it is. Thank you. And I am Jack or Miss Day. Whatever you want. Okay. Um. Excuse me, I am your new neighbor, Jack. I just moved in. Continue, please. Ah, Alejandra said that she's just listening. Um, okay. Who wants oh. to practice with Elena? Any volunteer to practice with Elena? Vilma. Me. Okay, Vilma. Me. So, Elena, hey. you're Jack, and Vilma, yeah, you're Mrs. Day. Go ahead. Okay. Excuse me. I am your new neighbor, Jack. I do. Love it. Oh, yes. I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there any around here? Yes, there are some on Point Strip. Oh, good. And is there is there a inundra mall near here? Near here? Well, I think there one across from the shopping center. Thank you. By the way, there's a barber shop in the shopping center too. A barber shop? Okay, very good. Thank you. Thank One you. more. Any any other volunteer? One. Me, okay, Gabriela. Who was your partner, Gabriela? Dalila? Gabriela and Dalila? Yes. Okay, Gabriela, you're Jack. Thank you. Dalila, you are Mrs. Day. Okay. Okay. Excuse me, I'm your net, net neighbor yet. I just moved in. Oh, yes. I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there any around here? Yes, there are some on Pine Street still. Oh, good. And there a laundry mall near here. Well, I think three on across from the shopping center. Thank you. Bye. Take away day a uh, barber shot. In the shopping center, too. I barber shop. Okay. Very good, people. It is time to stop. I'm sorry, we don't have time for more. Um, so we are going to continue tomorrow with this stuff. Okay. Have a good night, people. Thank you, teacher. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye, teacher.